हेलो स्टूडेंट्स माय सेल्फ डॉक्टर ज्योति शे गोकार आई वेलकम यू ऑल इन माय यूट्यूब चैनल व्हिच इज मेड फॉर द स्टडी ऑफ इंजीनियरिंग केमिस्ट्री इन दिस आर टुडे टॉपिक ऑफ डिस्कशन इज यूज ऑफ हार्ड वाटर वी हैव सीन नंबर ऑफ टॉपिक्स रिलेटेड टू हार्ड वाटर वी हैव सीन हार्डनेस ऑफ वाटर सो इफ यू हैव आइडिया अबाउट माय अर्लियर वीडियोस देन यू विल कम टू नो दैट व्हाट इज हार्ड वाटर एंड व्हाट इज what are all that basic topics required now today directly moving towards our uh, uses of hard water we have to actually study here that what will be the effects of hard water in our lives not only in terms of the domestic use but also in terms of the industrial use also generally uh, we uh, use hard water in the normal manner that means uh, hard water is found in a Uh, as a spring water that is well water then uh, bore water in uh, generally in everyone's house there is a presence of bore and whenever uh, there is a um, scarcity of uh, tap water or uh, we can say that soft water we directly use bore water but what will happen if we directly use that bore water for the domestic purpose and then next is the use on the industrial level so today we will see in some more detail that what will happen if we use hard water instead of soft one in our day to day lives now just having an idea about hardness hardness is nothing but the presence of different salts particular salts are responsible for hardness not all salts generally when we heard the word salt just in our mind there comes idea about nacl that is sodium chloride which is a table salt but no that is not the reason or that is not the responsible salt for the hardness but for hardness particularly carbonates bicarbonates sulfates and chlorides of calcium magnesium aluminum ferrous are responsible for example calcium carbonate calcium bicarbonate calcium hydroxide calcium sulfate calcium chloride likewise magnesium carbonate magnesium bicarbonate magnesium sulfate magnesium chloride all the other salts of magnesium that are responsible for hardness in the same way some salts of ferrous and aluminium like ferric chloride ferrous sulfate aluminium chloride aluminium sulfate these salts are responsible for hardness so all these salts whenever present in a water they forms scum with a soap you might have idea about hardness it is generalized or it is defined as soap consuming capacity of water means it is studied in terms of that uh, reaction with a soap solution whenever it is treated with a soap solution there is a formation of a scum scum is nothing but a white sticky precipitate which is produced instead of foam or leather which is not required for the different purposes so that's why use of hard water is harmful for the domestic as well as for the industrial purposes let us uh, understand that how it is harmful now use of hard water means now we are going to study here is that what will happen if we use hard water instead of soft one you have now idea that how that hard water is there from where it comes generally bore water well water spring water is a hard water because it is a underground water so when it percolates under the ground number of minerals and salts get dissolved in it in it and it becomes hard so that is hard water while surface water like river water like pond water it is totally soft water because not all total different salts or minerals are respond are uh, dissolved in it that's why it is considered as though there are found some suspended impurities it is considered as a soft water okay now let us start here there are two different types of uses either on the use of domestic level or on the use of industrial level i already written it on the board so that to um, get more time to elaborate so first is the domestic use on the domestic level for the purpose of bathing for taking bath we 
directly use hard water without thinking anything. But what will happen if we use hard water? Guys, when we use hard water, it is directly come in contact with us. That means the salts which are present in water that will directly contact with our body. With the, they may form some dead skin on the body. They may form some uh, dandruff in our hairs. So it is not useful. It should not be used. So always use soft water or clean water for the purpose of bathing. Next, washing clothes. As generalized thing or generalized definition is due to use of hard water, there is a or a, when it con reacts with the soap, it forms scum. It is a soap consuming capacity. So totally there is absence of foam or leather. So it will not be reactive on the any type of cloth or stem or any mud present or dirt present on the cloth. So it is always useless. On the other hand, that there is a formation of some patches or some uh, sheds will change due to use of hard water because of interference of that different salts in the reaction. So it should not be used for the purpose of washing clothes. Cleaning utensils, whenever the water is applied on utensils, we just think that there is no found water after it's used. But some invisible salts which are present in water that may be remained on that utensils and can be responsible for the formation of a different salts which can be directly just uh, used by our body or just it can be uh, we can say that insert in our body so it should also not be used then for cooking purpose directly for cooking purpose in some houses water which is hard water is used but it is not useful it should not be used because different salts present in it directly enters into different vegetables, sorrel, chapatis and it can directly uh, induced in our body. So it is not useful. Always use soft water for the domestic purpose. Okay. Now next on the other hand there is an industrial use. We might uh, have idea about industrial use. In the industry for example there is a sugar industry. Means production of sugar is continuously going on. And for that purpose, there requires water. Now, salts which are having sulfates, nitrates, they are having ions like SO4 dye negative, NO3 dye negative. These ions, whenever present in a water, these interferes during the formation of a sugar. These interferes to form the, to give the nature to sugar as a deliquescent or, or hygroscopic. Means whenever sugar will be, sugar is produced and it is placed in the ground or just on the open, what will happen? It absorbs atmospheric oxygen and becomes somewhat molten mass. So it should not be used. That's why we cannot use hard water in the sugar industry because these type of ions can interfere. Next is the paper industry. In paper industry, ions such as a Fe that is ferrous or iron, magnesium, magnes or turbidity which is present in water, it is very much harmful for the production of a paper because it, found, it is found that due to presence of such a ions that uh, papers have a different type of sheds, there is a formation of different sheds, then uh, ions such as the silica, SiO2, SiO2 type of ions whenever these are present in our water SiO4 or Si sorry SO4 or SiO2 silica these type of ions whenever found in a water they will interfere in the reaction as they may found they may found cracks on the paper so all the production can be useless due to presence of such type of ions or turbidity or silicate type of ions present in a water whenever it is used in the paper industry Okay, next is laundries. In laundries, whenever Fe or Mn type of ions are present in our water, in laundries, they may found the, you know, that uh, cloths which are washed, they may have a different type of sheds. Different stents are produced on it. That uh, if there is a white, uh, white color was there, it can become somewhat grayish. So, 
on the small scale also in lotteries it should not be used then next in the textile industry in textile industries the uh, solubility uh, due to presence of alkaline type of ions there is increase in uh, alkalinity of that particular water and if it is used in textile industry there may decreases acidity acidic dyes which are present there they becomes less concentrated due to which it cannot be used on textile industry on that level then in beverages beverages means soft drink industries soft drinks are made from the fruits and we know that fruits are having different type of acids in it again due to presence of such alkaline parts that acids can be neutralized and there is decrease in alkalinity also there is change in taste change in color so it cannot be used in beverages next in chemical industries chemicals they are used or they are useful for the purpose of different type of research so on that level it cannot be used because calcium magnesium type of ions will be interfere in between then boilers in boilers continuously water is boiling to get a superheated steam or vapor so whenever the different salts present in the water are there whenever hard water is used that salts can be interfere in between and there is a formation of a different type of sludge and scale these are the impurities so water which is required in a boiler must have a zero hardness so that there will be the proper working of the boiler is there otherwise the total tank can burst at a time because of such a boiler troubles like caustic embrittlement like boiler corrosion this can be there so that's why do not use hard water in the boiler then pharma industry pharma industry in pharma industry there is a production of continuously drugs for production of drugs and medicine is there which is very very useful for our health and on that particular level we cannot use hard water because in pharma industry there requires very clean water that is it should be odorless it should be colorless it should be free from total pathogenic bacteria any type of impurities must not be there so we never use hard water in the pharma industry as it is directly related to our health so uh, in this way we cannot use hard water in this particular uh, on this two different levels so we should not use hard water always use soft water as in the industrial level it is used but on the domestic level also always use soft water for getting more care otherwise some diseases may uh, cause there so that's why use always soft water so for the uh, study also it is important point that what will happen if hard water is used so this is there so if you like this video like it share it and subscribe it thank you very much